Hey guys, Katie here. So I am back with another video and this one is not um, really deep and serious. This one is exciting. So if you guys saw my previous video, it was titled I Don't Know. I wanted to thank you guys for your feedback, the comments you gave me. They were so uplifting. Some of them were like the perfect amount of critique for me. I really needed that kind of boost, um, that reality check from you all. And it's wonderful hearing for, from my viewers who have been watching me for so many years. So I love each and every one of you and I want to let, let you know, I can't talk. I want to let you know that I'm not going anywhere. I just sort of wanted to make that video to get it off my chest, to sort of open up to you guys. And I titled it, I don't know, because I really don't know what that video was. And I don't regret making it, but I don't know what it was. And um, I'm just happy that you guys had some good feedback for me. So without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and get into my unboxing of my Canon G7X um, Mark II. This is a camera I've wanted for so, so long. And it's going to fall off my desk here. I've got to be careful. Uh, I've wanted this camera for over a year. It's the vlogging camera that so many YouTube vloggers use, and I'm trying to kind of get more into the vlog type of videos. Uh, I'm not very good at it. That's something you guys did tell me, and I know I'm so bad at vlogging what I'm actually doing. It's useless if I'm just going to tell the camera what I did and not actually vlog it. So hopefully with this camera, I will feel more inclined to vlog in the moment and just keep it with me at all times. So I'm gonna go ahead and get into it. I don't want this video to be too extremely long. I got this Canon G7X off of Amazon. I got a really good deal for it because it's an international model, which basically means that it's just imported and not from actually the USA. And I did my research and that's okay. It's still the same exact camera. And I went ahead and got like the, the care plan or whatever that Amazon has. And I also was able to get the one that has an accessories kit. So there's a bunch of other stuff in this box that I am excited to show you guys. Uh, yeah, what I got. So let's get into it. So first up, we have this camera. It is so surreal for me to be holding this in my hands right now because I've wanted this for so long. And I'm just, I'm so happy and thankful. Um, I've had a full-time job for almost a year now, so I've, I've definitely been able to save up to get this camera. It was pricey, um, but I believe I paid less, I paid less than I would have paid if I um, went to like Best Buy or other technology stores or whatever because I got it off Amazon and I got the international version and yeah, so on and so forth. I'm gonna go ahead and get into it. I'm talking way too much. Okay, fun fact, I did film an unboxing video uh, when I got my first iPhone ever, and it is such a bad quality video, but it's hilarious. Like, I start the video off by stabbing, or like by holding the knife in front of the camera. I'm weird. I've always been very strange. You guys know that. So I got the Canon PowerShot G7X Mark II, if you're wondering. It's the Mark II one, not just the G7X. And this is the newest version, and I'm really hoping they don't come out with the newest, news, newest version in like a few months from now, but they probably will. Oh my god, this is like so surreal right now. I don't even know what to do. So it comes with an HDMI cable. Um, that's not an HDMI cable. Oh, that's interesting. So this is the European version of... Oh, I hope that doesn't mean that that could be an issue. All right, so I was in the middle of unboxing this camera, and I realized that because I bought the European version, this is just... I knew I was getting myself into this, but I didn't think about this. Um, it came with this kind of outlet plug thingy, which is a European outlet. I've been to Greece before, so I know that they have different outlets over in Europe, and uh, yeah, this won't fit in the outlets we have here in the US, so I'm gonna have to find either a like extension thingy, or I'm just gonna go ahead and buy a different um, battery that's American version off of Amazon. So that's not too big of an issue, uh, but it's, just, it's kind of a problem right now, because I don't know, I hope my um, camera battery came charged. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and see if it turns on. I don't think there's a battery in it yet. So let me open up this battery and put it in there and we'll see if it's charged or not. Yeah, we're good to go. So Canon do so next, if you don't already know, it has a flip up screen like that. And then I don't have a memory card in it, so it's yelling at me, but um, beautiful. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put my camera aside and open the rest of the accessories kit in my unboxing. First up, we have this. I don't know what it is. I'm assuming it has to do with dusting. Yes, this is a professional dust blower. Let's just give this a try. This looks exactly like those things they stick up baby's noses right after they're born. But apparently, it comes in handy for blowing dust out of things. Like that. Next up, this looks like a camera case that isn't going to fit my camera. I don't know what this is. Well, I, there might be other things that I have to attach to it. 
We'll see. So this is an extra battery. That's good stuff. This didn't come with the accessories kit, but I purchased a um, glass screen protector because I know I'm clumsy, and if I drop this camera and break it, I'm going to cry really hard. So I got one of those like screen protectors for the um, flip-up screen. Then they sent me a little lens cleaner. I think that's what this is. It could just be a cleaner for the camera itself, but it comes with a spray and then this like cool brushy thingy that pushes up. The best thing about this accessories kit is that it actually came with a tripod and I can always use more tripods. So yeah, tripod. What is this? All right, so this is a uh, professional series starter kit. It comes with a cleaning cloth, um, universal screen protectors, oh, cleaning spray, mini tabletop tripod, and um, cotton cleaning swabs. So this comes with like a whole set of things and I don't even know if I'm going to use this, but still, that's what I'm saying. I paid less than I would have if I got the American version, just the camera on its own, and I got a bunch of accessories. So I was excited about this too. It's a camera case. I will probably use this to travel with this camera, but I may also just buy a cuter case because this one's not very cute. So then we have an HDMI cable. I can always use one of these, although I'm never probably going to use it for this actual camera, but it still comes in handy. I used to use one of these for my laptop and I probably should start using it again, but this is really cool for if you have laptops that don't have a option to put an SD card in it, mine does. So this is just like a little extender for that. So I don't know what this is, but I'm going to guess it's for people who are active and want to like attach the camera to themselves, like kind of like a GoPro attacher, because it comes with a little like tripod thing. I don't know. I'll, another item, I don't, I'll have to, I'll have to look it up. I don't know. All right, this is what I'm super excited about. So this is what I'm gonna use, hopefully, if it works well, to vlog. It's like one of those, um, I mean, it's essentially a tripod, but it's like the bendy ones, and I probably should get like a monopod. This one's kind of big. So this is what I might use to carry my camera around and vlog with in public, but most likely I'll just use my hand. This is kind of nice though, honestly. This is a good quality tripod, mini tripod, whatever you wanna call it. So it turns out I did get an American version. This was like at the very bottom of the box. So I hopefully will not have to order a new one of these. Hopefully this is like legitimate and it works. Oh my God. Thank you, God. But yeah, this is good news though. That means I can literally have a charge record for if I go to Europe or whatever. And then I have one for here in the US of A. And last but not least, the most important thing um, that you need to function a camera and to take videos on it, an SD card. So this is just a 32 gigabyte one and um, the American flag is nowhere on the back of this. That's how you know this is legitimately an international SD card. Um, but yeah, it's going to work the same because yeah. I'm sure it will. Shout out to all my international viewers. Um, there are so many of you and it's so funny because like I I don't know where a lot of you guys are from but when you comment and say you're from somewhere else it just amazes me. I did a contest a few years ago and I picked three winners randomly and all three of them were from abroad which is just awesome. Personally I like other countries sometimes more than I like my country right now so it's lovely hearing from you guys who are international viewers. I'm trying to open this right now as I talk but I'm just going to worry about it later. Okay. Alright guys, so now that my desk is a mess full of camera equipment, I am so excited that I get to start vlogging um, and hopefully hopefully produce better quality vlogs. That's like the whole purpose of getting this camera. It's just a better quality camera and it's something that I've wanted for a long time, like I said. So if you guys have any questions down, if you have any questions, leave them down below. I'm getting too like riled up here. I can't speak. If you have any questions, leave them down below. Leave me feedback. Leave me requests because this is a camera I can film actual videos with, not just vlogs. Since I often have to keep this camera that I'm filming on right now at work because I bring it to work every day and I... Sometimes I don't bring it home with me, so I'm now good to go. I have two cameras. And yeah, hopefully you guys all enjoyed this video. I love you guys so much. Thank you for being there for me always, and um, I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye!